Yeah. Good morning guys. Well, it's pre 6 a.m. The sun is gonna rise in about an hour. It's raining and it's about 15 degrees. And I've got the light on because it's still so dark. What I'm doing is I'm waking up really early and gonna go shoot a place that works really well in the storm swell. I'm gonna head to Greenmount and get some shots. Now I got a new camera lens, but first we gotta get down there. So yeah, let's go. Siri, what time is sunrise? Sunrise will be at 6.34 a.m. today. And it's 16 degrees. It's 5.55. Sunrise is in another, what, half of 40 minutes. Um, hopefully it'll start getting a little bit lighter. Weather's miserable, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay. Ah. Right, right, right. We're at Coolangatta. I'm gonna try to shoot one of my favorite waves, this green mount. The swell's up, the swell's up to 2.2 meters, so it should be good. It's just really rainy, really overcast, so I'm not sure if the light's gonna come in time. One of the reasons why I'm waking up so early is because I bought a new camera lens, like I said before. I bought an 85 to 1 point, or 85 mil prime lens. Um, it's a 1.8 f-stop, so that'll be good for your low light situation, so that's why I'm getting up early. I'm going to test this thing out, see what it's capable of. Um, hopefully there's some good barrels and some good waves. Why am I getting up so early? I mean, this is what you have to do if you want to get different shots and different shots so that what everyone else is, else is getting. You've got to get up really early, sunrises, even when there's conditions like this when it's... I'd rather be in bed, but you get interesting different shots. Anyway, let's get the wetsuit on and wait for sunrise. <laughs> GoPro, where's your low light capabilities? I hope there's waves. A couple green mountain freight trains. The one's sort of just breaking. It's pretty darker than what it looks like on screen. And there's one, two, three surfers out there. Like there's some good little, uh... oh yeah, look at that thing. Nice. Yeah, so I can take my time getting out there because it's still not, as you can see from those last photos, it's still not bright enough for me to take good photos. So, I mean, the light just gets brighter and brighter, slowly, slowly. So hopefully by the time I swim out there, it'll be light enough to take some photos. Okay, I can see it a little bit better now, so there are some barrels. The biggest sets are probably maybe three foot, so it's not super pumping, but it's good quality, you know. Low tide, perfect. Hey, we're getting a little bit more light, guys. A little bit more, a little bit more. Oh, what is warm. I mean, this is one of the good things about the super bank in this area is that in a strong southerly, it's super calm, it's offshore. So it's really cool. Quite a few surfers out already at dawn. It's impressive.
Okay, dudes. The current's really strong. I'm getting washed down quite quickly. Oh, the metal on the back. Shit. bloody rainstorm and a half so I gotta go in I'm getting tripped around to Kira so before I do I want to get into the shore before I get so around but wow that was awesome just got some good photos in the rain <sighs> now it's a long walk back to the car Yeah, they're still barreling. Okay, how about that session, dudes? That was pretty bloody good. I mean, it just goes to show you, that's what you gotta do. You gotta get out there when the conditions aren't the best. I was pumping the ice so really high because the light was so low. And then that rain squall came through and it was just amazing. Just the light fills up, like it's just, all the rain just lights up, but you can't see anything. So you gotta keep like a surfer in focus so you can get that sort of third shot of the surfer at the bottom and then all the rain and the, the drama of the, the weather above it. Um, but the 85 mil 1.8, it worked really well. It was pretty, it was ended up being a pretty good lens for the job. Um, I had to push the ISO really high. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Like it was, uh, it was a bit different, you know, doing it in the rain and and I guess it was what, you got, what I got to do, I got to mix it up a bit. So yeah, anyway, hope to see you out in the water one day. Hey, subscribe to the vlog, please. It helps me out a lot. And I'll see you next time. Cheers.